18-year-old Billy Joe Saunders. He's adapted quickly to the pro game. Two second round knockout wins in his first two fights. He's the former world number one junior. Up against Matt Scriven, always comes to fight. He's been in with some good men and has won a couple of minor belts. When he's not boxing, he does security work in Iraq. We can join this from the start. Billy Joe, Billy Joe, touch gloves. Phil Edwards wanting the respect there. We may have some fun and fiery nights ahead with this strong, hard-hitting southpaw, Billy Joe Saunders. He's made quite a start to his pro career. Two straight stoppage wins, both Sitting in the down. second round no as well. Up against Matt Scriven, the hardened British circuit fighter and part-time security man. Very much a journeyman, but he says he will give it everything. How will Saunders cope? with opponent number three. Well, good Scriven, right yeah, good Scriven. right straight. I was just about to say Scriven is a journeyman, but he's a proud journeyman. He always puts on a show. He gets regular work, doesn't win too many, but he's good value. So it's the type of opponent uh, where Saunders will have to concentrate, no, not do anything, so he'll just take his time. A lovely right hand from him. Good shots found by Billy Joe Saunders. And his opponent, Matt Scriven, rates him as a prospect, but he'll try and get close and then land a couple. Yeah, Saunders just walked on to a left hook there. I mean, he's doing the right thing, he's putting uh, Scriven on the back foot. You just have to be a little bit careful as he moves forward himself. He's a proud and competitive journeyman, Scriven. Saunders looking to get set, the straight left hand. This all-action style, lovely jab from the southpaw stance. I mean, Scriven, you don't expect him to be good enough to, to, to beat Saunders, but he's good enough to make him look bad. But uh, not managing that at the moment, this is impressive work from Saunders. A good combination from Saunders there, and quick in and out with a jab and blood to the nose of Matt Scriven. He tries to fire off a few body shots as a riposte. Oh, but look at those from Billy Joe Saunders. Just going to have to be careful of the, the heads. You know, the, you know, he likes to work the body, throws good body shots, but just uh, old fox like Scriven, just have to be careful the heads don't come together. Just get the sense that he wants to get the job done in double quick time with Billy Joe Saunders, only 19. Oh, wonderful work. Too quick for Scriven there. Well, not too many 19-year-olds could bully Scriven the way Saunders has done in this opening round. This is impressive, he's taken a few chances, fair enough, he's taken a few clips around the ear. But this is an impressive opening round from him. Winding up a massive hook there, Scriven. Oh, left hand, a beauty from Billy Joe Saunders, and a right. And he's catching Scriven with ease. Yeah, and that's because Scriven himself is trying to come back with some punches. He's not got into a shell to his credit. He's trying to make an argument of this, but he was punished there twice. Rattling around the ribs. And a tough last 20 seconds or so for Matt Scriven there. Good ring, Slim. Give him a good Spray him. One of the most experienced trainers nice. we've had in Britain, Jimmy Tibbs, who raves about Billy Joe. Well, Saunders uh, dominated Scriven in the opening round. I thought maybe the first round, round and a half or so, he could have some problems. But he got right down to work, these are quality punches, that's the heads coming together that I, was, I think he should be a little bit wary of. I mean, Scriven, the old pro, keeps his chin down, so in clashes of heads, Saunders could well come off worse, but look at the quality in the punching here. Taking charge completely right from the start. Right. So keep him off balance, <laughs> all right? I want that send, send that right into the chest, OK? So and need that right Tony Harris in Scriven's corner. Away, you often see Scriven right doing the corner the work to right, other right, fighters. All right. I think he's heard it all before. Look at it, looks pretty tired after a round. Here's the second, 12 stone super middleweight division. I think the gum shield, uh, Scriven's gum shield hasn't been replaced. He's found us, we aren't the floor, don't know how that happened. 
In the blue trunks, the 35-year-old stalwart from Nottingham and the sparkly red of Billy Joe Saunders looking for his third straight victory since turning pro in February. And this the round where he got jobs one and two done. He want to make it a hat-trick, I think. I mean, this is good from Saunders because he's looking for the target. He's, he's deciding where to place the punches. He's not treating it like a race to see how quickly he can get the other guy out of there. Tight defence, chin down, looking at... You know, keeping his eyes on the target. What's coming back at him? That's clever, that's clever. Yeah, pushing Scriven back there as well. He just pushes his glove to the floor, almost a touchdown. Good jabs, combination, headshots. All getting a bit tough in there now for Matt Scriven. I mean, you have to admire Scriven. Under fire here, but he doesn't grab hold, doesn't spoil. Tries to cover up. That was a lovely punch right through between the guard. Yeah, the uppercut was a beauty. Could it be a third second round stoppage for Billy Joe Saunders? It is! There's the hat trick. Matt Scriven halted in the same session as Attila Molnar and Ronnie Garble. Billy Joe Saunders does it again, and isn't he good to watch? You couldn't ask for better than that. Some professional fight, perfect. OK, Scriven may be a little bit too brave for his own good if he'd spoiled, if he'd tried to get himself out of there, but that's not what he's about. He's about trying to put on a show, trying to fight back. Completely outgunned, and how impressive the way Saunders took over right from the start. And it was a way he, he never took his eyes off where the punches were being aimed. Look at the concentration, body, head, the hooks, uppercuts, just showing everything. And then, as I was saying about Scriven, tries to fight back, no holding, no spoiling, proud journeyman. But he's going to have to have a little rest now because he's just been stopped. And that's one thing he won't like but the referee had no option whatsoever. Yeah, not that many people do this to Matt Scriven this quickly. No, nope, not many 19-year-olds would be capable of doing that. This little kid, I think, maybe something special. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the time of 1 minute 21 seconds in round number two. A referee in charge, Phil Edwards, stops the contest. The fighter in no condition to continue. He is the winner by way of TKO and still undefeated, Billy Joe Saunders. Billy Joe, the knockout run continues. How do you assess that performance? Um, I just listened to Jimmy and uh, Mark. We got the tactics right. Went back in the dressing room and okay, said like we, that Matt don't get stopped. He's been there with the best, and he's gone four rounds and six rounds and twelve. But I went and I stuck to my game plan, and uh, all worked out. And I just, just like thank Frank Warren, thank Frank Warren, and uh, Dean Pell. You prized them opening body shots. Is that what you've been working on in the gym? Yeah, I, when I was amateur, I didn't used to throw body shots at all, but. Since I've been working with Mark and Jimmy now, they've got me doing stuff I didn't think I could ever do, and now it's all coming out and I can only get better. Trainer Jimmy Tibbs, he's just 19. Will it be a problem holding him back? Uh, no, um, I'm sure that uh, Frank Warren, his manager, will make sure that he gets the right fights and uh, he'll be brought along nice. And uh, that was going to be... I didn't expect it to stop that guy in two rounds. I did expect uh, probably a late stop. He'd say when I say late, fourth round or so. But if it had gone the distance, the way he was boxing, I was over the moon. But he's caught him for some good shots and the referee done his job. Well done tonight. Thanks Thank very much. Cheers, boys.